can play guitar Just look at me Anybody can play guitar Just look at me Don't believe what I say Just watch me and see First I grab my son a cord Working from the sky to the ground Then I grab another chord to make a good sound Then I work another chord For what's called a turnaround Anybody can play guitar Just look at me Now if you bought that game You're plugging the TV You know the one that makes you look like a player like me Hey, here I am again Welcome to Anybody Can Play Guitar, and once again, I have to say this, peace to all those who enter here. Okay, now, our subject, this episode, let me see, this is episode 15 maybe, I don't know, who cares? But this is an important episode because we're going to discuss the basic approach to the guitar, like we do sometimes anyway, but this is a real classic approach, and it's maybe complicated, but like I'm saying, if I can pitch these papers to the side and say, just do what I tell you to do, that'll be it. Anybody can play guitar. So the subject would be basic technique to guitar and basic approach. So let's start with those sweet beginnings. Here's how it started. You saw and heard a guitar being played. Does it sound like you're in court somewhere? You finally picked one up and decided to learn how to play one. You're guilty, okay? You saw six strings. Listen to this. You, ha you haven't heard this before, but each string is called a chorus. Each string is called a chorus. C-O-U-R-S-E. So a six-string guitar would be called a six-chorus instrument. The term double chorus means two strings together as one. Thus, a 12-string guitar would have six double choruses. This kind of uh, uh, talk like chorus and uh, technique and this, that, and the other is from the use of earlier stringed instruments like the mandolin, lute, and whatever else they used uh, earlier. So here we go, getting earlier. So we go into the uh, late 18th century. If you haven't heard this on anybody, on anybody can play guitar before, the strict string was added to the guitar after 1830 or 1835, and the five-string guitar which was an earlier instrument, was called a vihuela. Okay? You heard that before. Vihuela, then six string. To some, playing guitar was not easy for a beginner. Okay? So you had to learn, you know, stuff like, uh, you had to learn music. Oh, this is a staff. You had to learn this. See? This guy here. You had to learn how to count notes and rest and... Uh, you know, hold your finger down and stuff like that, but right here on Anybody Can Play Guitar, only the thumb and back of the neck, fifth and six, six string roots of the chords we're gonna learn, and uh, here it is, what makes it easier, and this is another thing, somebody may call me a copycat, hmm. but one person, Madam Sidney Pratton, she was a child prodigy on guitar, wrote a book called Guitar Simplified, her real name was Katharina Josepha Pelzer, and she had a sister. She was born in Germany and grew up in England. Her father was a musician, and uh, she played a company with her father, Niccolo Paganini, Fernando Sor, Zani Di Ferranti, Jules Rigandi, and others. She was also instructor to uh, Queen uh, Victoria's daughter, Princess of Wales. And um, like I'm saying, the sweet beginnings are what I'm explaining to you. And you know, you might pick up things as you play guitar, but that's what's gonna make it fun. You're not gonna do all that. Uh, I forgot how to count the quarter note, or I, I, don't, I don't wanna do it anymore. Playing guitar is fun. Playing guitar is fun. And I said so. So now, one of the most difficult things in the sweet beginnings of any instrument is reading musical notes. So you gotta learn two things at once. Here, all you gotta do is pick up the guitar and start plunking on it. Or if you miss, just keep going. You'll, you'll get it right. 
So, on Anybody Can Play Guitar, all the technical stuff is kept to a minimum. And uh, like I said, playing guitar is fun, and you'll pick up all that stuff. If you're more interested and more interested and more interested, you'll pick it up and have fun all the way. Early classic guitar playing consists of bass note and melody tones. Usually, the bass note is held for at least two counts or more, while the melody notes are played at the same time. So, um, usually the performance becomes more complicated as the song continues. So, it's called piano guitar, so you really sounding like two, three people. You're holding bass note. Next thing you know, if you ever watch a classical player play guitar, you'll see um, it's really something. It'll take a long time to play that good and that fast and uh, play that way. That's called piano guitar. That uh, term uh, really uh, identifies that uh, type of classical playing because it's almost like playing a piano. So the method of playing that I just talked about really planted itself into the countries of Europe. And it's gone a long way. It's still gone and on and on. It's going and going and going. They still do that all over the place, especially in Europe. OK, so here's another European similar to her predecessor. And I'm talking about Ida Presti, another child prodigy. Another child prodigy was Ida Presti. She was 14 in uh, German-occupied France. In that picture you see, she's been in a couple of movies overseas. She was stranded in France with uh, Django Reinhardt and Stefan Grappelli and other entertainers. And uh, they had a quite a hard time back then. And um, I don't know if she had a sister, but uh, that w picture you saw was Ida Presti. So uh, guitar was considered a lesser instrument in the 18 and 1900s for some reason. They, they liked violin players and trumpet players and flute players and brass. You know, the people, you know, felt that way. And uh, as far as we can, I can take it with um, Ida Presti, they were just starting to recognize the value of a classic uh, uh, guitar player. And uh, she was born in May 1924 and died in 1967th of April. And she married a guy, uh, Francesco Lagoya. Okay, she was born as Yvette Montagnon by her, uh, her parents, but her father, who was a musician, named her Ida Presti, said it, it sounded better than uh, Yvette Montagnon on guitar. So uh, Americans were, were flowing through at that time, you know, uh, especially after she died in 67. And, and like from 50 to 67, they, man, there was a real boom and a crunch on guitar players. It, you know, Charlie Christian and a lot of people were coming up. Uh, um, who else? Uh, a lot of people. They had Django Reinhardt. They had people that w were outstanding and just, you know, um, hey. He had to give her a name, just like her name is Elvis Presley or something. You know what I mean? So she studied harmony and music theory and um, played uh, at uh, Sal Playel in Paris when she was a kid. Lauded for her prodigious talent by her teachers and contemporaries. She recorded for the French arm of the HMV record label in 1937. While still under 12, she played at the Passel Loop concert, the Society Desk Concert du Conservatory for two consecutive years. And uh, here's another one. She played in a film, La Petite. And as a 16-year-old, she played uh, Niccolo Paganini's guitar. He played violin. And uh, she played his guitar because he played guitar on the side. She played Paganini's guitar at a commemor commemoration of the centennial of his death in 1940. So she did a lot of stuff. And um, like I'm saying, doing a lot of stuff counts. When, it, when you look back and then you run into your sweet beginnings, you say, hey, man, I did a lot of stuff with this guitar. First, it wasn't fun. Now, it's, I'm, I'm almost a professor at it. So 
If you look in YouTube, you'll find quite a bit of classical guitarists from Europe. Long live the guitar. Madam Sidney Pratton worked at making guitar playing easier because she wrote a book called Guitar Simplified. Remember that, Guitar Simplified. Not anybody can play guitar. I make it simpler than her. So, <laughs> and if you look into youtube.com slash anybody can play guitar, you'll find a similar establishment. So if you can get down to, uh, you can pick up the guitar and play it already and be more simpler than I am, you've really done something. Okay, your basic approach being on anybody can play guitar is less technical approach, not like classical, not becoming boring faster. Learn while having fun at the same time your progress is up to you, thus the term sweet beginnings. Okay, we make it uh, cheaper and cheaper as we go. We don't learn all those fancy chords and finger stretches you saw Ida Presti do in that picture. We do chords with the root on the fifth and sixth string till you get more interested in what you want to do. So um, that means you can control your own creativity, learn to play the blues faster on anybody can play guitar using the fingering pattern method. The fingering pattern method that I showed before, we're gonna, we're gonna play, that's a 13, that's a seven, and here's what I called to you was a fingering pattern. You can do a lot with those six notes. Anybody can play guitar. Learn to play blues faster on anybody can play guitar. Learn things your friends won't tell you on anybody can play guitar. Don't forget youtube.com slash anybody can play guitar. What a slogan, huh? Anybody can play guitar. I just said my prayers, I got no reason to complain Driving down from Meridian, well in the summer rain Oh, there's a storm watch, something seems so intense Looking down the road at Laurel, Hattiesburg, New Orleans Signed a big old contract, kick out in Baton Rouge Got my woman beside me, I love these stormy blues Baby, I'm taking you with me, everywhere I go Reason for that is because I love you so these stormy blues She'll make me sing Love's an umbrella for everything She's a rainbow of my dreams Looks like an angel in boots and blue jeans Long time ago, well, my grandma talked to me There's more to love than the common I can see First time I saw her, had to keep my place Telling her I loved her, first time I saw her face She stole me blue, she made me sing Love's an umbrella for everything She's a rainbow of my dreams Looks like an angel in boots and blue jeans I'll pick her, I'll be one to the day I die I play them down home blues I don't even have to try Lord puts music in my feet A little bit of money and plenty to eat River flows up to my farm Fish jump into my arms The cows in the corn, so blow your horn 
Mississippi is where I was born. Down old Highway 45, it's a two-lane road. A vision of perfection, lo and behold. Now the one I love, I'm holding tight. There's no wrong, I'm Mr. Right. Farmhouse built with logs and my good old hunting dog. Howling through the woods, praise the Lord, it sounds good. Bruce screams, listen to him sing. Fly by my window, flapping his wings. Y'all get up, got work to do. Don't forget to feed me too. Sun slipping down, hello to the night. The air is turning cool, and the moon is mellowing bright. And the one I love, I'm holding tight. There's no wrong, I'm Mr. Right. I got thunder in my heart, the greatest jump start. True love puts a hold on you, best feeling I ever knew. Woke up this morning to the rising sun, possessed by love, and she's the one. It's as true as two can do, best feeling I ever knew. Looks me in the eye, gives me a kiss. I'm a fool for her, God is my witness. And the one I love, I'm holding tight. There's a wrong, I'm Mr. Right. Music station, sweet and soft. Oh Lord, I'm getting on. True love puts a hold on you, best feeling I ever knew. Are the place to go. It's time to kill my pain. Feel like the wind and the rain. All the angels are out tonight. Shining like early morning light. Neon eyes and rainbow smiles. Country music is a style All the women, they make me wonder Hey, they're the lightning and the thunder Every soul so sensitive It just wants to live and live All the bridges that got burned I do home, it may concern It's time, yeah, to kill my pain I feel like the wind and the rain Put my name in the marquee lights Fast living on moon burnt nights Midnight it rolls on and on Put a whole bride on the dawn All the women, yeah, make me wonder The lightning and the thunder Honky Tonk Angel, please keep me here From the foolish things I did Take me home, I'll be your toy 
You're a strong man, oh, you're a humble boy. It's time to kill my pain. I feel like the wind and the rain. Just look at me. Anybody can play guitar. Just look at me. Don't believe what I say. Just watch me and see. First, I grab my summer chord, working from the sky to the ground. Then, I grab another chord to make a good sound. Then, I Work another code for what's called a turnaround. Anybody can play guitar. Just look at me. Now, if you bought that game, you're plugging the TV. 